And looking finally against counters to the jab, we're going to look at destroying the hands, okay? Which is really nice because as soon as someone jabs you, if you can start attacking the hands, uh, they don't really want to throw their jabs anymore because every time they break, they get hurt, right? So, option number one is to actually punch the hand. Now, all she needs to do, she needs to rock back on the first one. She's going to hook the inside of it. So as she leans back, she punches my hand as hard as she can. Which is good because she's not really leaning in to, you know, start punching in the face. She just starts attacking the arm. Eventually, three or four big shots, my arm starts, you know, not to work. And, uh, you know, builds up over the course of the fight. So, option number one is to throw a big left hook. Bang. Option number two is to lean back and throw a big right uppercut underneath the hand. Boom. Now, the good thing about this as well is that if she hooks it hard enough, bang, it then opens up for her to then follow up with different things. Same thing with the uppercut. If she destroys the hand by punching it and knocks it into a different place, she can then follow up with different things as well. And then option number three is to hammer it, which is really simple because if she goes to me, I just lean back and I just smash it straight downwards. Usually I'll follow with a left hook, right cross, left hook, and then kick after. But you can make up your own sort of combo after that. So option three is to hammer it. Bang. Now what you don't want to do is leave your head there on all the punches. Because if she jabs me, because she's going to be stepping in and I try and hook from here, it's not really going to work. So you just got to move your body weight back just a tiny bit. So as she jabs, I rock back and hook it. She jabs, I rock back and upcut it. She jabs, I lean back and hammer it. So those are the three destructions that you can use as a counter uh, to the jab. There are other ones, a bit more uh, taboo, as we should say, that you don't really want to use in kickboxing, but we'll save those for another time.